Hey everyone, this is my sixth video log in which I'm sharing how I turned the Ionic application to a Shopify one. So let's get started. So till now uh, we were able to get the entire flow done uh, except the part where we need to get the access token from the server. Uh, the issue that we are facing is uh, when we are uh, sending the request uh, without uh, making it a multi-part request we are not getting the uh, the right response and when uh, trying it with the multi-part request we are not getting uh, the response in the success block so uh, we we have two options for it one is to go for the exists uh, to to go with any other libraries like the exists or uh, we can have this uh, this thing implemented at the back end itself because uh, we, we will need to store this access token uh, at the server to make further API calls. So uh, what I did is uh, uh, I've created an API as it is a uh, HTTP server, uh, sorry, as, as it is a Java based backend application. I use the uh, Apache HTTP MIME library uh, to make this multi-part request. And uh, the good part was that the, the library was already in, included in the project. So I, I used this library and I uh, was getting uh, the response right and uh, I was able to store that. And uh, okay, after uh, doing that, uh, and I got to know that uh, the backend server had some other HTTP client, REST HTTP client as well, and that uh, also supported it quite well. Uh, that was a wrapper. So finally, I used that. Uh, so this is done. Uh, now let's see how the app looks. Okay, so this is the class that we uh, that I was talking about, multi-part entity builder. So I, this is the one initially I used uh, to get the access token. So this is how it looks now when I install the application. We are redirected to the installation page. When we authorize the application, we are redirected to our application. And here, once the verification is done and the access token is available, we are again redirected to the app page. So this is what, what is done now. And that's that's all for today. Thank you.